Hello guys. Uh... Okay, so um, basically today we'll be looking at how to edit in a photo on your Nexus 7, which i uh, got to admit some people do like. We're going to look at the Google version, so this is comes with the Nexus 7 No app. So first of all, you need to install or save an image from your browser. Simply uh, hold your finger down on the image and it will se and select save image. Once you've done that, to make life easier, we'll just do it this way. We'll go to the far left icon and select it. Go to our gallery. Um, and there are many photos you should have installed. Here's one that I kind of like. It's um, it's just of an Android kind of thing. Very good quality, so won't let you down there. And you'll notice that in the corner here we have this like toolbar. So all you need to do is go to um, oops, you need to go to the far right hand one, and it's not very clear, but it's just these like three dots. And you select edit the second one down. Now you get this um, kind of toolbar at the bottom too. Uh, now there are many things you don't want to screw up really here, so you've got to be careful. So first of all, we have um, this. This will be okay, but we have we can, you know, bring the contrast up, light or dark, um, which is which is pretty nice. We can bring it right up on the back too uh, we can have a shadow so quite dark which is is quite nice with the slider here it's very easy to do oops um, <coughs> yeah it's quite easy to do in FX which means effects um, we have things like um, this one which kind of like makes it to a cartoon type thing this one's more of a like an Andy Warhol type type thing um, and we get more and more better effects as we go along um, which is quite nice as you can see um, you know we can do negative I don't like that so you just select it again um, saturation doesn't really work for the, that effect uh, we can make him look a nice beigey colour type thing and basically you can just do many things we have here flip as you can see we can flip the uh, photo and the effects are really very good um, sharpen there we go um, and if you're just like, if you just install it before you go on holiday or something, you can actually get quite a lot out of it. And what I mean by that is, um, you know, you you won't really get bored. You can crop the photo too, very easy. I just thought I'd show you because it's so good. Now, if you go on to the uh, paint palette icon and you go right to the end here, there's a selection called Doodle. You simply select Doodle. <laughs> Um, and you get this colour sort of um, palette at the bottom there. Um, you select a colour. I'm going to go for a nice uh, blue, I think. This, and you can just sort of colour in your Android if you want to. Yeah, um, you can write on it. You can do whatever you want, your finger is basically the brush um, you could do it multicoloured you know, it is totally up to you but um, you know, there are lots of apps that aren't available on um, say, the iPad which are now available on this as a default um, this is free, as I said, it's a default so that means it comes with the Nexus um, as you can see, I'm pretty much done because, well, I'm not very impressed at what I'm draw doing here. Um, but, yeah. And you can, you can save it. I don't think I will. And if you don't like it, 
you can simply select these back arrows too. So I hope you enjoyed that um, video. Um, it gives you a little insight on the uh, camera quality and photo quality and editing you can do on Nexus 7. So thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe. Like I always say, comment. We'll be doing, I think next we'll be doing a case review for this um, Nexus 7. If you want me to do a video, please let me know and I'll see if I can do it. Uh, but until then, stay tuned for more videos and thanks for watching.